you are on Patreon account. We have Zoom to net. Zoom is a platform we use. Actually, I've been using Zoom for a long time, probably five years. <laughs> we use it right now to have a live chat, to connect with the members. So if you are a member on Patreon, no matter what tier you are, you are welcome to join the call tonight at 7 p.m. Eastern time. And if you're looking for directions and or the link, uh, if you go on the page, you will see, you will see the link. It's pinned on top of the page. So please do that. It is a beautiful day outside. I can't wait to uh, breathe some fresh air. It was a very busy day, but um, it's so very beautiful out today. Hi, James. Hi, Lance. Yes, I'm reminding you guys. We have a Zoom call tonight at 7 p.m. Um, Eastern time as usual, Michigan time, guys. So I have a message, sort of a thought of the day. And I was thinking today about something. A lot of people um, living in the past, a lot of people have hard times overcoming their trauma. They have hard times to get over the excess. They have, they have hard time to um, get over whatever situation they have in their life. And I have a very, uh, you know, powerful solution to all of that. Even though it comes from the person that is also very reflective and very thoughtful, but sometimes you have to take fast decisions. Sometimes you have to turn your life around. Um, and I was thinking today, even though I'm not a sports fan, I don't really know uh, very much about sports. I don't watch sports, as most of Ukrainian women do not. But something I want to share about that. Uh, when you have final countdown or at the sports game you have a final countdown right and there is a coach and you have uh i don't know last minute last 20 seconds your coach does not go over and give you lecture about your past the coach and you as a players figuring out the best strategy to turn this game around to turn this game this game around uh, you don't go over the past who said that who threw the ball in the wrong way you have count down the clock is ticking and you need to take the best possible decision to give the last shot because before your clock is done <laughs> right before uh time is over and you have results of the game so pretty much i feel that uh if we apply same thing in life and stop waiting and endlessly reflecting on life uh, endlessly thinking about she said this he said that um we do have a countdown and none of us have an idea when, when it's going to happen. It's always making me smile when, you know, I talk to people who are, uh, well, you know, who lived a lot longer than I did so far. And they tell me that they are hoping for this and hoping for that. There is no hope. <laughs> you have to manufacture certain hope. You have to... Um, you have to make the hope it has to be handmade it's not the hope that come you know something whimsical you know it's something that you just have to do right so and this comes from the person that once again knows 0, 0.0 about sports but i understand the strategy i do understand the idea that you have that much time and the count the clock is ticking <laughs> so would you rather in that time would you rather uh, go over the mistakes and who did what and i honestly do not believe in mistakes i'm one of those weird people that do not believe in mistakes um i think there are no real mistakes but there are experiences experiences are real thing mistakes um i don't believe in them Everything you had encountered was meant to be 
to take that personality inside of you that is asleep. You have to live through certain experiences. So, so some people <laughs> walking with a dog, I don't don't want to freak them out. <laughs> okay. So I think they're going behind. All right, just a minute. Hi, everyone. <laughs> Corner route in football. Yeah, I wouldn't know. As I said, I don't know anything about sports and I don't think it's going to happen. But thank you for for help, Bill. <laughs> and hi, everybody. I am on my phone. Um, and I see you all coming coming in. Thank you so much, guys, for commenting. And here is a, another uh, aspect of this. People will tell you, will spend hours upon hours telling you uh, what went wrong, who said what. Uh, they will tell you the story of why something did not happen and how unfortunate everything had happened. They will tell you, they will spend literally, literally the best hours of the day uh, tell you or what went wrong and how unfair things are and you know things are not working out and blah 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 if you ask them so what do you actually want it, most of people would stop in their tracks and they just be like um well i wish um yeah that would be nice so basically other words some more sun i don't know guys if you can see me <laughs> other words if you ask people what they want um a lot of times they will not have an answer and my own observation that the best thing to best way to get over something as well is create new desires find new ideas do something new so if you can talk for hours upon hours upon hours how unfair was your first husband your second lover your grandfather was mean to you uh your babushka was out of control you know some people live their entire life because somebody did them something and they they're going for 300 years to to for a therapy session instead of doing something new and this is this is the message uh of today guys if you can talk hours upon hours about things you hate about your life about things in the past why wouldn't you take the same amount of time to talk about and create something that you actually want most people do not have um, any clear vision for what they actually want so if you continuously relive in the past how in the world you can have enjoy the present and have the future i'm just i'm just trying to anyway <laughs> how if you keep even the past how can you create the future you gotta focus on what you want here is the catch you cannot think at the same time about what you want and about what you don't want it's impossible it is impossible you can not at the same time want something and do not want something so long story short instead of uh thinking about you know your ex-wife and how unfair and oh my god i lost some money oh you know my my uh my boss this be become the boss yourself do your thing i cannot tell you how much i can take sometimes a uh you know boxers use that thing i forgot how you call this uh bag punching bag and put some gloves and just like beat that bag because you know i have to keep myself being professional but i keep listening you know this is my work i keep listening people just regurgitating all these stories over and over again and i'm thinking to myself you wasting so uh much time yes exactly you can't drive looking in the rear view mirror exactly so don't focus on on what you don't want focus on what you want focus on where you want to be uh sometimes when you ask people they don't even know they think that somehow things will appear 
sometimes people that think they don't even know what they want but they think that things will somehow magically appear well good luck with that <laughs> so you know there is definitely final countdown on just about everything we are we have to be in a hurry to be present to love to do what we want to do uh there is no uh there is no manual and you don't know you don't know how long you have to be on this planet you can't snooze your life in hope for the miracle to come and so for for it's just a reminder, you know, just a reminder for, for us that, you know, yes, I am all about going to a professional. I am all about speaking to a person that can support you. But also, I'm all about taking control and turning your life around. Because nobody... Okay, I see a bug. All right, guys, this live video is over because there is a bug in my car. And I'm not about this i'm gonna turn this bug's life around right now nasty little creature <laughs> with that being said oh my God. with that being said guys from michigan with love don't waste your time focus on what you want Focus on what you want. My countdown is right here because actually this bug's countdown is right here. You little nasty creature. From Michigan with love, I'm going to see you soon. Remember about countdown and remember I'm not Indian so I'm going to kill this bug. So remember son of a gun. Son of a... No! Oh my god! Okay, guys, I'll see you soon. <laughs> oh my god. This is literally the ugliest thing I've ever seen in my life. Come here. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> I love you guys. I will see you soon. And uh, hop on the call if you can. Focus on what you want while you can. I'll see you soon.